Hey air signs, welcome to Taylor Zoli Tarot. Just doing a little mini reading for you guys regarding what you need to know um, during this full moon that is happening today as I film this video tonight actually, um, October 28th. So I just pulled three cards ahead of time. Again, welcome to Taylor Zoli Tarot, I'm getting tongue tied. So there may be something regarding communication that you guys are dealing with. Welcome to see the Zuli Tarot. Please like, share, and subscribe. Um, so yeah, there's something with, because I'm not being able to speak right all of a sudden. Um, we have regret, um, suffering, and silence. We have self-love, creation, and then we also have autumn, which water signs had this card as well. So some of you may be um, dealing with a lot of repressed emotions at this time, holding back. A lot of things within not really um expressing yourself as you as you should and that's kind of what i got when i first started and i was got tongue-tied um, in my introduction um there's something regarding there's something you're blocking either it could be communication or just repressing again your emotions but you're really needing to focus on self-love on what you're trying to create and manifest at this time during this full moon this full moon is really asking you to please focus on your heart's desires on your, and to value your self-worth at this time um there is expansion coming with whatever it is that you're trying to manifest especially now during the full autumn season um if you're in the eastern hemisphere okay to let go of the past the suffering and silence regrets you, we need to let go of that we need to let go of the past we need to start over your soul is not wanting to grow there's a clearing new new intentions are needed right now and but most importantly there's a focus on you you're wanting to manifest things but you're also needing to take care of you air signs libra gemini aquarius you're needing to love on yourself and focus on you underneath the deck we had here um inner child so some of you may be needing to focus do shadow work on your inner child wounds but there's a lot of healing that is going on at this moment. Self-discovery, self-worth, self-love. But let's go further into what this is. Please clarify the regrets, the holding back, suffering and silence for Libra here regarding this full moon. Let's clarify this further for Libra. Gemini Aquarius air sign what is this holding back regrets during this full moon yeah there's an imbalance here of your emotions you guys are really like in your head there's an imbalance of your emotions you guys may be having some money issues as well but definitely with the two of coins and the king of cups has to do with your emotional emotional intelligence and just you know your trust you may not trust a lot of people you may have lost trust in people with suffering and silence that's what you're holding back so there's an imbalance right now that you guys are going through maybe it's feeling a little depressed clarify this with the air signs Clarify what is this with the air signs? Clarify for the air signs. Did something flip here? Clarify for the air signs. Okay. Again, we have a love affair. So you may guys may have found out about somebody not being faithful. So that may be why you're you're imbalanced in emotions. And we have roller coaster here. So yeah, high uh, adrenaline. Your 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 emotions are up and down, up and down. There's something that came about, some type of secret that is gonna come about during this time for you guys. Archangel Michael is under the deck, so know that you are protected. Archangel Michael is here protecting you, air signs, and he is like the saint basically. For um for everyone. 
but um, for air signs. Maybe you can light a candle so Archangel Michael say his prayer. He can help you. He can help anybody. If you, if you feel compelled to, you know, to reach out to him, he will. He will be there to help you. Especially in, in, when it comes to protection. Um, but yes, here we see there's some type of ups and downs and emotions definitely because of something that um comes to comes to light some secret that comes to light regarding trusting someone this could be a king of cups and air sign dealing with a water sign what is this self-love oh we have queen of cups so we have king and queen of cups here so this is a queen of cups that's nurturing herself that's you know, going within and put, put pouring self-love into herself at this time. Oh yeah, we have something that is definitely over with the death card. And we have here the six of cups, returning to one's roots. Yeah, so returning to oneself. You're no longer nurturing somebody else. That's what I'm getting from this. You're no longer nurturing someone else. putting your energy into someone else you're putting your energy into yourself going back to your roots okay and this this is childhood and we have child inner child healing here so there's something that you're transforming there's a spiritual transformation there's new beginnings there's letting go definitely here going on and just going back to you with the self-love here Focusing on you, pouring onto, onto you. Because there's been too much unbalance with whoever you were dealing with here. Especially if there's a secret that comes out. Clarify. Self-love. Okay, so put those two that's on the table. Yeah, we have intervention, rescue, others involved. So you're feeling... You know, like you're in a hole at this moment. You may be feeling like you're in a hole and you need to get out of this hole with suffering and silence. Okay. Again, with this um, little secret that could be in, that could be um, others involved or that could be that somebody coming in to help you, to uplift you. Yeah, come together. Reconciliation, spiritual union, soul contract. This could be your partner wanting to come back. But I don't really feel you're letting go of that though. Your partner may be wanting to come back after this secret comes out, air signs, but you're focused on yourself. You're focused on yourself at this time. What's under this deck? Yep. The roads being open. Projection. Don't let the, anyone project onto you and don't project onto others. But definitely the road being open for you to move forward. What is this autumn signing card? Okay, we have the King of Swords. So finding out truth. The truth coming out. Okay. And we got Justice. So you're going to be getting truth. You're going to be getting sh the structure that you need, the strength that you need. Okay. Underneath the deck, what do we have? We have Ten of Cups. So there is happiness. Hey, Air Signs. I don't know where my camera cut out, but I will go back to over here. Um, where I was saying you have, this may be you feeling like you're in a hole at the moment. The person after finding out the truth of this love affair may be wanting to reconcile come together i don't think that is happening because we have the death card here someone may be projecting onto you or you are projecting onto others don't do that at this time the road is going to be open for you to be able to move forward clarifying the autumn card we got the king of swords and we got justice so you are cutting free after finding out the truth um of something you are cutting free from that Okay, getting over the past, and this may be a karmic lesson that you have been, um, going, you know, learning, 
and there's going to be rewards that are coming your way after this you have the ten of cups so definitely rewards and look ten of cups and then we also have seven of pentacles so look ugh, can't make this up a five of cups so after the loss you have you're looking at the invest investments that you've made um, but they're the hard work is gonna pay off because you're gonna have ten of cups so don't worry don't you don't have to deal with this imbalance um, of emotions here unconditional love genuine certain love so maybe that is something that will be coming through for you that will be your reward to then be able to get unconditional love let's see what and it says pop up suspicious unexpected vi uh, surprise visit so this could be that you finally out of you know eventually after going through all this the full moon is going to help you cut something free and unconditional love will be coming in unexpectedly okay underneath the deck we have settlement agreement so i feel like there's something that you probably unloved that you probably will need to let go air signs and new love will be coming in not only will you be loving yourself and pouring onto yourself but it looks like you probably will have unconditional love a partner coming in eventually after you have healed that is your full moon message air signs ashe